We're not using the CE. Do we even have... Are we missing mods? We at least have concealment mod. Okay, actually, it looks like we have all four mods. Um, we can bow tank everything except champagne. I think the biggest problem with this Wichita is the 1.8 Sigma instead of 2.0, like the CE. So hitting destroyers will probably be fairly trolly. Uh, the furthest range we can get on Legends is like 22 kilometers. Nowhere near what they can do on PC. Although I think I prefer having a shorter range because I don't really like the fact that on PC you sit, you know, 30 kilometers away sniping in battleships. Like this game is already passive enough when it comes to battleships. I don't think it needs to be any more passive. Okay. I don't know what the difference between Wichita EP was. I think it had better pen angles but it had a shorter fuse or something or longer fuse don't actually remember okay we're unspotted uh does our destroyer not want a cap like i'm literally covering the cap with my radar American destroyer players is is it gonna get buffed just like the Fletcher I would imagine it is Torpedoes, direct front. Uh, that accuracy though Can our Sumner play the objective? Hello? All forces, capture that area. Hello? Teammate, I need your support. Cap. Once Tirpitz dies. Okay, something is in B cap where that Tirpitz was. Edinburgh should go forward since he spotted again. Capture that area. No, not that. I want you to shoot that guy. On the designated target. Two shell hits out of nine, and he's broadside. This is the new Wichita's poor accuracy that I was talking about and after I complain I get six out of nine There's a disagreement about range versus concealment in this game. Prefer second option, so concealment. There's no reason to use RGA. Because if you build for range, you're getting at most two kilometers more. So it's kind of pointless.
All right, Edinburgh's probably gonna come around the island. Probably try to just YOLO in and torp. Or not. Oh no, he is. Dang it. The enemy team has taken the lead. Just really wish we had better accuracy so we could kill this Edinburgh sooner. We're only getting one citadel at a time. Alright, what are we spotted by? Is it the the hipper. Is that champagne with that plane? You got Tirpitz is dead. No, that's Chapayev's plane? Oh, no, it's Hipper's plane. I see a champagne behind him though. No, why are you turning broadside to their battleship, Iowa? Or New Jersey? Alright, is Chapa up dead? Okay, finally. Actually, I thought that was a champagne. I guess it's not. There's the champagne. Might be an issue. Okay, there's their last destroyer. I think you need to try to go unspotted. Edinburgh's right in front of us. Dead? Why are you turning broadside to where the torps are coming from? Please don't. Enemy cruiser foundered. Torpedoes dead ahead. This guy just got cross torped. Summers. Problem solved, sir. Oh, I'm spotted. I did not realize I was spotted. the fire. He just damage count it. 
Alright, I'm just gonna sit here. I can tank his shells. Unless he gets really lucky and somehow citadels us through the stern or something. Or off the turret. Destroyers in the cap. Landed short. Oh, that's Citadel me. Bismarck's improved pen angles. Can I get a fire, please? And without seeing where their champagne's at, this could become problematic. There's the hipper. Why is there Sumner being the kind of person to hide and only want to farm damage? Their destroyer left the cap. He's gonna have to smoke up. He's on fire. This guy had four kills. So close to a Kraken. Sumner died. Mines has to kill these two. And then I need to kill this Bismarck. Unfortunately, I ate that Citadel. Two minutes, they're at 900 points. Maybe I just need to somehow ram him. And pray that our uh, pray that our mines can kill. Definitely not going to kill him here, though. Maybe I just stay behind him. So his secondaries can't shoot me. Oh, never mind. Well, that's really unfortunate. That one Citadel. I mean, I don't think we're going to kill him if we even touched him. Probably needed to... Uh... Actually, after he damage con that single fire is probably the only chance I had. Sumner couldn't really get anything else done. He was more focused on farming than torping. And spotting. Well, I guess we can play the CE version now, since that's the better version of the Wichita.
I'd imagine that's over a 2k base game and a loss. I mean, the Wichita, the non CE version is not bad, obviously. I mean, it's still a Wichita, still has the speed, maneuverability, detection. Just doesn't have the accuracy and a slightly different uh, main battery gun performance. You can bow tank everything except Kansas. Hmm. I think I might just have to somehow kite around A. It's not really an island I can just park next to. I mean, I could just bow in on that island. But I feel like if their team pushes out that way and there's a Kansas or something, I'm kind of screwed. Yeah, I think I play on the outside of A for now. And then I can always try to reposition as needed. Uh, no camo Yugamo. Well, he's probably gonna be outspotted by everything. So, Ochakov. He's already turning out to kite. It would have been unfortunate if he actually set us on fire with that last salvo. But now we can push back in, try to deny the cap from any of their destroyers. None of their battleships being spotted is a concern though. Is our Yugumo spotted? Yeah, I think he is. He got torqued by an Akizuki. Oh, you couldn't smoke me up, Fletcher? You're gonna smoke up behind me? See, we're getting two citadels in every salvo with this ship. Enemy cruiser destroyed. You recently received the double strike and two close quarter medals in the Iowa. Was that all at the same time? have a minute until our radar's back. I think we can just use this uh, Fletcher smoke though. 
Oh, there's the Kansas. Our Iowa sailing broadside to their team. Does he not realize there's two battleships over there? Well, unfortunately, we just lost our fully packed. We're not getting any RNG on this Rishliu either. Trying to set a fire on the front half of the ship. Oh, once again, we just had to say something. Alright, set our double fire so now we can just go unspotted. Go unspotted, get our radar back, push back in for the Akizuki. Bismarck shooting Ichi and sailing broadside. Alright, cut it back. Can I show my commander build? Yeah, I can show my... I mean, it's my basic uh, stealth radar beeply build. Maybe I should have stayed next to the uh, Bismarck for my sonar as well. Because I'm kind of in front of him where he's headed, so I'll probably eat torps that's not meant for me. Akizuki might be giving that guy will as well. I think I might... Oh. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Poor timing. Well, I just pray Kansas doesn't shoot me and death strike me. He didn't shoot at me. That's perfect. But yes, this guy was giving that guy will. If we can set him on fire, he's gonna die to the fire. Oh, he shot. We sunk an enemy destroyer. Kansas is still shooting Ichi. Oh, he's not looking at us. Well, that works out. It's the double. I wonder if he damage con one of. Oh no, there's his damage con. Is it Kansas looking at us? It is. What's their last cruiser? Carno? Yeah, I should turn away. He's still shooting Ichi in a Kansas. What a disgrace. Am I using the same build on my Des Moines? Yep. Stealth radars are just so useful and honestly allows you to have so much more carry potential I have no idea why this Kansas is shooting Ichi he would have killed the Bismarck like 10 minutes ago There's the Carno. He's turning in now. Someone's looking at me. Is it the Kansas? 
Did he switch to AP yet? Oh, he did switch to AP. He switches to AP now. He was shooting HE that whole time. Really? Come here, Carno. Uh, he's going a lot faster than I thought. Alright, he's got AP so we can bounce all of this. Close quarters expert. Oh, no, unfortunate. If only we killed that Rish Liu. Nearly a million credits, only using the uh, rare booster. 3,800 base XP. Wichita CE getting it done. Alright, wait, um, before I go to Commander, I'm kind of curious how that other game ended in terms of RXP. Oh, 1.1 million credits. 2,800. Okay, so let's do some math real quick. So, 2,800 times 0. 0.5 plus 2,800. Oh, uh, if this was a win, this would have been 4,200 base XP. That's so unfortunate. But clearly, clearly the nerfed version of Wichita, or clearly it's nerfed even though this Wichita did better than the CE. <laughs> but uh, in terms of Commander, this is Shelly Beepley, it just has the Miss Santa guys on it. But it's full Concealment build, or Concealment Inspirations. And maneuverability for running down destroyers and then private zone is why we can get a, a stealth radar because our detection is nine kilometers and the radar is nine and obviously fully packed because by the book is kind of useless and also fully packed is just probably the best choice for any radar cruiser because you'll probably have a sonar and heal that you also Get an additional charge. 